Good afternoon, I'm Zane Parsons. Hello, my name is Zane Parsons, and I am your host for the Tanked Test. Hello, and welcome to another episode of Straight Up. I'm your host, Zane. Newswatch at Noon reporter Zane Parsons tells us what baseball fans can look forward to this spring. The Athens varsity baseball team likes to keep things lighthearted, but this year they're eyeing a very serious season. The team lost their season opener to the Lancaster Golden Gales 5 to 1, but they are sharpening their skills for the busy week ahead. The experience gained during gameplay is much different than practice. The Bulldogs have games scheduled every day this week, but head coach Chris Stewart has some concerns. It looks like Thursday might be the only day um, where, where we're possibly going to be canceled, but uh, um, I hope we're not. I hope we do play all those games. Um, we're just going to use every day to try to get better. The Bulldogs will be playing as a completely different team than last year. With nine of their varsity seniors already graduated, many juniors are filling the positions. Although the Bulldogs baseball team has faced some early challenges, they still believe that there are a lot of strengths to showcase this season. Senior captain Hunter Mullins has complete trust in his teammates' abilities. We just need to hit the ball this year, and so our defense is pretty solid, and if we hit the ball and execute, I think we'll win a lot of games. With a new roster full of positive players, Bulldog fans can expect to catch some great baseball this season. For Newswatch at Noon, I'm Zane Parsons. It's a big scary world that needs some exploring. There's only one guy and he'll do the touring. He's got anxiety, a dad body, and a camera too. He will travel far and wide and show it all to you. It's fresh, less squeezed. This is episode one of Freshly Squeezed, and I'm here in my hometown of Louisville, Ohio. Paris, France. La Spiezza. I'm here in Rome. Minori, Italy. Greetings from Austria. Did you really think I could come to Amsterdam and not make a video? And I'm in Dublin, Ireland. Thank you so much for watching, and keep things fresh. Ah, that's gross. I'll figure something else out for the next episode.